The police emergency medical intervention fund is aimed at providing immediate financial assistance for the medical treatment of police officers who get injured in the line of duty. The fund, which was instituted by the Inspector General of Police, Dr. George Okufu Dampari, also aims at mitigating the financial plight of personnel. Already, three serving police officers, namely Chief Inspector Victor Anako, Inspector Terry Zohene, and Corporal Isaac Opoku, who got injured in the line of duty, have been earmarked to be flown outside the country for treatment as first beneficiaries of the initiative. President Okufado, who made the personal donation of 100,000 cities to the fund, says it will go a long way to help personnel. I've been assured the beneficiaries do not have to go through the usual bureaucratic and the associated del delays which have been in the past. Resulted in some cases in personnel losing their lives whilst awaiting treatment and the deterioration of medical conditions of some others. As we present the first three beneficiaries of the fund, Chief Inspector Victor Anako, Inspector Theresa Ohine, and Corporal Isaac Esuman Upoku, with amounts covering the cost of medical treatment in Ghana and abroad, I'm hopeful that all police officers who require medical treatment will receive the best of care without recourse to the cost of treatment. The IGP, Dr. George Okufo Dampari, thanked government for the many support the Ghana Police Service has received over the years, adding that they will discharge their duties effectively. This is what you have been doing for us as a service, and we will forever be grateful. But in a spirit of reciprocity, we want to assure you that we will continue, and I mean we will continue with all our might to act professionally, to act humanely, and to act tirelessly in order to ensure that we protect life and property and we maintain law and order. On this note, we want to once again welcome you, Mr. President, for the opportunity and the honor done us for being here today to commission these projects for us.